Storm Team Digital Doppler right now showing you not anything really going on over the top of us as far as rainfall is concerned. Some big storms going on across northeastern Missouri where they do have a severe thunderstorm warning just to the east of Kirksville. That's going to stay away from us. And looking back to our immediate west, uh, towards West Plains and up towards Rolla, just a few very isolated showers moving across south central Missouri. And we'll continue to see at least a chance for an isolated shower, although precision cast is indicating by 5 o'clock some pop-up showers. I don't think that's going to happen around here today. But as we go into tomorrow, that'll be a much different story. We'll see another late night uh, complex develop out to the west and then move off to the east, bring us the clouds by morning. Notice by 7 a.m. Precision Cast has a line of showers from West Plains up to just east of Columbia. And then this line will start to fizzle out like it has the last couple of days. We could see some pop-up thunderstorms in the afternoon and the evening. And then we see another chance for some thunderstorms as this upper level low and surface low begins to move overhead for Friday. And it looks like we're going to see the chance for showers on Saturday. We're also going to see the chances for uh, showers on Sunday as well. Now the Storm Prediction Center also is indicating a slight risk of severe weather uh, from 7 a.m. Friday through 7 a.m. Make that 7 a.m. Thursday through 7 a.m. on Friday for all of southeast Missouri and these counties or portions of Illinois and western Kentucky and uh, northwestern Tennessee. I think the main threat there would be during the early morning hours Friday with maybe some hail and some gusty winds. And then the threat is right over the top of us during the day Friday as this low pressure begins to move over the top of us, which could create a little bit of spin in the atmosphere. As to how much rain we could get, this is one of our forecast models that we can look at, the GFS. And to give you an idea of how much rain we could expect out of this, the models are backing off a little on the rainfall on Thursday. Day. But then it starts to pick up Friday and then going into the weekend. So just by Friday evening, we're looking at anywhere between a quarter of an inch to a half inch of rain. And before the weekend's over, I don't think it's out of the question. We could see some places uh, around an inch of rain or so. And of course, if you get under a thunderstorm, you can have higher amounts than that. 80 degrees Thursday, 76 Friday, cooling off to 66 by Saturday, 64 Sunday. Uh, light showers by Sunday, cloudy by Monday with maybe a chance for a few light showers as well. We're back.